Um, 23 years ago, um, I made a very tough decision in my life, a decision that not only affected me, but also affected, you know, the rest of the family. Um, I dropped out of school. I pretty much was on the streets for 11 years. For 11 years, I did nothing with my life. I couldn't stay on a job. I couldn't keep a job. I had no discipline. I had no structure. I was just a lost soul. Um, finally, in the summer of 2001, I knew that I needed to really make a change in my life. And so in 2001, uh, I decided to join the military. Um, I got discipline, I got structure in my life. And once I got that, that allowed me to establish my faith. And once I got discipline and faith in my life combined, I became a new person. And that new person became a strong individual an individual who took responsibility for his life, an individual who pretty much wanted to better his life. And so I worked very hard to make something out of my life. Uh, when I came home from serving overseas uh, in Iraq, um, I was diagnosed with cancer. I was diagnosed with Hodgkin's disease, lymphoma. During that time, I really grew closer to my faith and just really started to continue to utilize what the military had given me and what my faith had, had established in me and continue to fight through the negative that was preventing me from becoming a more positive person. And when I did that, it felt good. And that in Quincy turned me into becoming a better man, which I am today a better father because of that um, period of time. I think our military is getting hit hard. And you know, I think that Republicans all have always been strong in military practices and building a very strong foreign policy. Once I started getting into politics, I wanted to understand, well, what are my values? And once my values equated with the Republican Party values, then that's when I knew that um, I had become um, an official Republican. And it was great. And it was great to know that I was making this decision for myself. And it wasn't a decision I was making because of the norm, which I think a lot of um, you know, minorities really get into is like making that decision based, based upon the following. I make my decision based upon my values and who I am. My name is Travis Angry. I am a proud single father of two beautiful kids. I am a new author of the book Change If I Can, You Can. And I'm also a youth inspirational, motivational speaker. And if I can add just one more soon to be movie producer of an amazing faith based movie that's going to be a title based upon my book Change If I Can, You Can. But most importantly, I am a Republican.